Okay. Thanks for the ride, Chloe. Right on time for my art lesson. Thanks for coming with me. Sorry to be so boring. Nothing exciting ever happens to us, right? Listen, your rewind power has to be connected to that snow yesterday. That might explain your tornado vision. I don't see how. It's so friggin' random. Wake up, Max. You saved my life twice now. You altered the course of my destiny, yours, and whoever. Do you know about chaos theory? Uh. Yeah. Uh, it means shit happens, right? No, well, crazy shit happens. Because it can. And will. Why me? I'm just a geek girl in some small town. A perfect example of strange attractors? Do they teach you kids anything at Blackwell? We have a tornado, rewind power, and freak snow. Hello, Armageddon. So let's party with your power, Rockstar! Like he said, Professor Price, a superhero needs a sidekick. How can it be such a shitty week and yet one of the best of my life? Because we're back in action again. Good, good. Ab in die Klasse. Bevor wir zu spät kommen, natürlich. I have a little time before Mr. Jefferson's class, so I can do some laundry. Good thing I left my AK at home. <laughs> this is good. A trophy. Blackwell sure takes it swimming seriously. But yes. ours will Zach. Sup, Max? It's weird to not see you without your camera. I'm always taking pictures with my eyes. I bet. As long as you don't talk to everybody about all that shit with the sex in Victoria. It's over. it's over. Just another Blackwell mini drama. You mean stupid shit. Man, I just don't get Victoria. I mean, what does she want? Probably for all of us to talk about her. Like now. Then let's not. You're pretty smart, Max. See you at the game Friday. Good. Justin. Justin always looks dumb. Poster. If I was normal, I'd be super excited about going to a major shindig. Good. Here we are. That snow was so insane. Seriously. Hello, climate change. Okay. Hey, Courtney. Ciao, Max. No photos, please. I have to come up with a guest list for a Vortex Club soiree. Really? Oh, like you care. You're right. I don't. Making my guest list easier. Ciao. Trevor. Trevor surveys his domain. David? Excuse me, Mr. Madsen? I know things got a little heated yesterday in Chloe's room. Was that really your reefer? No, it belonged to a friend of mine. Are you gonna bust me now, Mr. Madsen? Even I'm not that much of an asshole. And I am sorry about yesterday. I was wrong, but upset. Cannabis is not a big deal to you. But it has been to Chloe. You're a combat veteran. She's no threat to you. If I didn't care about her, I wouldn't care at all. When I was her age, I was outraged a lot more hell. She's better than that. All you kids are. So is Kate Marsh. <laughs> oh, 
What's about Kate? What about Kate? You step between us at a pretty bad time. She's another matter entirely. Kate hasn't done anything wrong. Max, this isn't just about Kate Marsh. My concern is for the safety of all Blackwell students, including you. That'll take more than surveillance cameras. It will take more than Ms. Grant and her petition to find missing students. Isn't that your responsibility as head of security? Unless you know something about Rachel Amber that nobody else does. I don't want to fight with you anymore. I don't want to fight with anyone anymore. That's all, Max. Okay. Rowan. I still have time. I could go see Warren playing mad scientist in the lab. Hey Warren. Are you okay? You look thoughtful yet confused. Maxwell Silver Hammer! Perfect timing! I need help with this chemical experiment. Asking me for help means you're screwed. I have to add either a bit of potassium or sodium. It's up to you to decide. Dr. Max? Um. Maybe I have a mission. Godium. Godium? That's the worst one I've ever heard. Yet Max has spoken. Sodium it is! Damn. Zip. Nothing. Nada. Hey. Think, big brain. Think. Hey, Warren. Asking me for. Have to add either a bit. I'm not sure why you're letting me decide your fate, but go. Potassium. Potassium, it shall be. If this works, you get a free hug. <laughs> Weird science. Yes, I am a scientist. Fuck. Bring me the brain, Igor. This can't be that hard. Yes, I am a scientist. Fuck. Who? Brooke. Howdy, Brooke. Hi, Max. Making your daily rounds? I'm helping Warren with his latest experiment. Oh, I guess he needed a neophyte assistant so he wouldn't be threatened. But you came to his rescue anyway. My nature. Apparently it's my nature. Yet Warren ignores the experts right in front of him. Not that he would ask me for help anyway. Gut, ich glaube jetzt müssen wir mal in unsere Klasse. Help me? I'm trying. But you have to understand my position. Why? You don't understand mine. Don't be Can you yeah. Please leave me alone. Okay. Sorry to bother you, Mr. Jefferson. I'm only bothered when you avoid turning in photos. But you know this. So what can I do for you, Max? Just between you and me? I'm worried about Kate Marsh. That's no secret. Word on the street is that you and Kate had a little confrontation with our security chief yesterday. Hmm. Never mind. Yeah. I stepped in between David Madsen barking all up in Kate's face about something. She doesn't deserve that. Of course not. <laughs> Mr. Madsen isn't the most gentle soul. Do you have proof he instigated the situation? My word isn't good enough? The one time I choose not to take a picture. Always take the shot. My number one rule of photography. And Max? I promise this matter is being discussed by the faculty. I assume you know about this viral video? Kate is freaked out by all of this. She can't do homework while she's being tormented on a daily basis. What if Kate brought this on herself? She means well, but maybe she doth protest too much. She seems like she's holding back the truth. Have you talked to her? 
Yes. Yes, I talked to her on the phone today. She needs friends and support now. I just don't want Kate Marsh to become the next Rachel Amber. Rachel Amber? What does she have to do with Kate? With all her missing persons posters around, it's hard not to think of her. I miss Rachel too. But think about yourself, Max. Principal Wells told me about what you said happened in the bathroom. Mm. I think... That was a private conversation. Not that I wouldn't tell you. This is a serious accusation, Max. So you don't believe me? I would never make something like this up. I hope so, Max. But it's easy to point fingers. If Mr. Madsen claims you might be a pot dealer as he did, should I believe him? Listen, should I...? Excuse me, Max. Hello? Yes? Um, uh, hold on. I have to take this, so just go into class and I'll be there soon. Okay. Also, ich werde jetzt als Draftdealer hingesetzt. Sehr nett. Dina, you are out of control. Turn left, then right. Show me the love. I'm kind of doing something now, Max. You look like ass. No time to talk, Max. Posing in progress. Do you think Max will be pissed we're sitting at her desk? Oh, I'm sure she'll report us to the principal. Like I give a flying fuck. Better be quiet, Victoria. We have a master snitch and liar here. And paparazzi. I want that photo whore or I get nasty. Too late. Oh, burn! Max is so fearless when she has backup. Right. Can I sit at my table now? Don't get cocky. This isn't over. In fact, shit's just starting, Max. Okay. Assholes. Um... Okay, why is David taking photos of Kate? Now this is so wrong and weird. This is really wrong. Die beiden gehen mir auf den Sack. Rowan. What up, Max? Hey, Warren. I saw Kate earlier and her eyes were puffy from crying. Kate has a lot on her plate. I didn't know what to say and she, she didn't tell me anything. Okay, I know you love me, but if you're not in this class, be it. Everybody else, please sit down. We have to cover today, and so little time as usual. I see all the usual suspects here. Anybody seen Kate Marsh? I think everybody has seen Kate Marsh by now. <laughs> She's not feeling good. Sounds like you're giggling about a video gone viral. Maybe it involves a student? Or a friend? I wonder how it would feel to have false images of yourself shot out all over the world for people to judge. Usually, people need something to judge so they never take a good look at themselves. We can thank reality TV for some of that. In the end, we can only blame ourselves for participating. Uh, Chloe. Yeah, this is too short. Speaking of participation. Okay. <laughs> okay. Shit. There are a few souls here who have yet to enter a photo in the contest. Like Max Caulfield, for example. Who I know can't wait to enter, right? I'm sure you read the syllabus like it was a Harry Potter book, so you must know today we're studying. Hero, hero. That beautiful word about the contrast between light and dark. The shadow play that gives photography such visual power. It's basic yin and yang. Black and white images are effective precisely because of their contrasts. 
Although we don't technically see in my- Yo! Some crazy shit is going down in the girl's dorm! Zachary, do not come into my class like that ever again. Listen, everybody remain seated. Dismissed. <laughs>